In this video, we're gonna turn this woman into a collage. So let's start. Okay guys, so let's start from here. So as you can see in the layers, I only have this woman with background picture. So what we need to add is some squares. So let's go to the rectangle tool and add some squares. So I'm gonna create a 360, 360 height and width square. I think that's fine. And now let's go to the fill and change it to this color, which is 009593. And now go to the stroke and put it to none. And let's move it and hide part of the woman here. And now hold Alt to get the two cursors and just drag to copy it once. And press Ctrl T to scale and transform and rotate it slightly and hide another part of the woman. And now press Enter and do it again. Hold Alt and just copy and hide another part of the woman. And make sure you change the direction so you'll have a nice effect. Okay. And keep adding squares until you fill the whole woman. And when you look at the layers, you would find you have all these rectangles. So what we need to do is, let's place woman with background on top. And let's go to the magic wand, click on it, and click select subject. And it will automatically select the subject here. And now with the plus sign, just add the stuff which are not added in the selection. And there's a spot here. So after you select the subject, go to select and select and mask with the refine edges here. Just add some of the hairs here. Click on them and it will refine the edges. And some parts of the hair here. I think this is fine. So now go down and output to new layer. And press OK. And you will have a woman, let's name it woman. Just woman, I think that's fine. And now let's place the woman with background at the bottom and turn it on so we would have the background. And the woman, you can just create a copy on top of each rectangle. So hold Alt and just drag while holding Alt on top of each rectangle. It will create a copy. Okay. And now let's create clipping mask. So go to the first woman and right click on it and create clipping mask. So it will be connected to the rectangle underneath. And let's do the same with every other woman copy. So let's go to this one, right click, create clipping mask. This one, right click, create clipping mask and do the same for all the rest. So every rectangle is now connected to a woman copy. So now what we need to do is let's go to the rectangle one and right click on it and blending options. And let's add a stroke and make sure it's 15 and opacity is 100 and inside position. And now add a drop shadow and make sure it's multiply black opacity 60 and size 51 and press OK. And you will have this effect on one of the rectangles. So let's do the same thing with all the other rectangles. So you can just go to the effects here and hold Alt and just drag on top of the other rectangle to copy the effects to the other rectangle. And you can do that to all other rectangles. And we're done.